Ian. And what's your birthday? August 9th, 1999. <laughs> Be quiet. <laughs> and what book have you got there? Melrose Once in the Den of Professional Help. And did you like it? It was amazing. And what was one of your favorite parts? When Melrose Muntz and Annabelle were being really sarcastic to Massimo and Nautica. That was amazingly, extremely funny. I do not even know how to describe it. Cool. And uh, wait, <laughs> Great. so I forgot to say, so how old are you today? Nine. Okay. And when they were being sarcastic, um, did you like the words? Did you like the writing? The words? Yes, they really sort of, well, for me, brought new ideas into your head. But uh, it was, they really, well, the writer really made it so you could laugh. And it was just a really funny book right there. And I really, you really have to read the book to know. All right. And was it hard for you to understand any parts of the book? No, the only thing that I need explanation on is like um, when I when there's a joke or something mm -hmm. that was uh, like one joke or something that was a little bit higher mm -hmm. than my uh, level of level? yeah okay. uh, well on my age level really right Harry Potter only had like a chapter. Mm -hmm. about the ghosts and really didn't make but that's the really only big ghost one I can't really do you really like I mean have you read all the Harry Potters yes and many times have you seen the movies yes own them so you like books in series I like books in series oh also another great book was the lightning thief that cool. was amazing super keen and would you like to have another a series of Melrose Muntz books? It could easily make a series. Would that be fun? For the reader, it would be amazing. I mean, the uh, the author, who may I mention, Douglas Anthony Cooper is his name, and he had perfect writing for this book. I mean, really spectacular writing for this book, and. All he would have to do is think of another mountain that had to be sort of crossed <laughs> for uh, the, but it was, <laughs> he has everything. All he needs is another bad guy, really. And then he could easily make this book. Do you think that it'd be fun to have Melrose Munch and like Damage Dave and Arabella and another adventure? They would, they could, I mean, he could really make a good book about maybe like a civil, a civil ghost war or something, <laughs> like, like a ghost war at the school or something. Uh, this book hasn't been published in America yet. Do you think kids in America would like it? Where was it published? In England and in Canada. Well, I, I think if the UK got published it and the Canadians got it published, the Americans are definitely missing out. Big time. And any things that need to be improved mm -hmm. in it, in this book, mm -hmm. is practically percentage zero. Cool. Minus zero 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 zero. <laughs> All right. Um, but I think if he made a series of these types of books, gave it to Americans and whoever else in the world he wanted to. Like Australia. Whoever, it doesn't matter. In any language this could be, or in anything it could be, a great experience for kids for kids my age. I bet a bunch of friends at school would like this book. Mm -hmm. I mean, and for older readers, like my mom loved it. I think a lot of other kids would like it. 
cool. And Grown Ups, for that matter, it really is an amazing book.